All new tonight at 8, LAPD looking for this man right here who they say killed someone on a metro train. It all happened last night on the E line. Good evening, friends, and welcome to KCAL News tonight at 8 o'clock. Also streaming live on CBS News Los Angeles. I'm Chauncey Glover. Let's get right over to KCAL News assignment editor Mike Rogers at the desk tonight. And Mike, you dispatched SkyCal to the murder scene I know last night. What are police saying tonight? Chauncey, they have just released new video and pictures of the suspect. This happened on the Metro E line. One passenger stabbing another passenger. That passenger ultimately died of his injuries. I want to take you right to that video. This is that passenger, the suspect now, standing on the platform. He's the one wearing the black suit sweater and the jeans here seemingly just talking to those two other men here in the video uh, before he kind of walks away. This is a really good look of that suspect. Generally, we don't get such clear security camera video in these things. So uh, the fact that we're getting that is actually pretty good. Look at his face right there. It is pretty clear. Now the LAPD has identified the victim uh, as a 20 uh, man in his 20s. Rather, uh, they don't won't tell me right now the connection, though, between the two. They say the victim is 27 year old Jaleel Sosa. Iera. He was suffering from stab wounds. He was taken to the hospital uh, where he was ultimately pronounced dead. Now, this was the scene last night as SkyCal was overhead. This was the E-Line station, uh, kind of in the 2400 block of South Flower Street. And again, really no idea why this happened, what the motive was. I just talked to a sergeant over there at the uh, LAPD's uh, transit division, and he tells me they're still trying to piece all of that together to figure out if there was some kind of confrontation between these two or whether or not they knew each other. All of those details still unclear tonight, Chauncey. All right, Mike, thank you.